Have you ever noticed that when planes fly from a place to another place, they don't take a straight path? Instead, they curve their path, almost touching the North Pole, and then come back down. But why? Wouldn't they take a straight path that might be faster? Well, that's where our eyes and the map make us fool. You see, Earth isn't flat. It's a 3D sphere, slightly wider around the equator and narrower at the poles. So the shortest distance between two points on a sphere isn't a straight line, it's a curve line. It's something that called a great circle root. A great circle is the largest possible circle you can draw on a sphere. It divides Earth into two equal halves. For example, the equator is one, and flight paths follow this invisible circle to minimize distance and fuel. Here's it gets crazy. On a flat map, a great circle root looks curved and longer. But in reality, it's the shortest path possible. If you fly directly from Japan to New York following a straight path on a map, you'd actually travel more distance than your curved path from north over the Arctic take. So that strange looking curve across the globe? That's not a long cut, it's a shortcut. A path that saves airlines thousands of liters of fuel and millions of dollars every single year. Amazing how sometimes the longest looking road can actually be the shortest. Follow for more such mind-bending science facts that'll make you see the world differently. Like and subscribe for more this type of valuable content.